Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another Player Unknown Battlegrounds video and today we're going to be talking about the best places to loot because I know you guys have just got this game and you're wondering, you're trying to learn the map and you don't know where the best places are to loot and if there's any good places that really aren't very well known that you want to loot. So before I start the video, if you guys are new, this is the first video you're watching. I hope you do enjoy the content that you're seeing and I hope you do decide to stick around, subscribe to the channel and I hope you do like the video and if you don't then it's okay. But like I said, to Darren talking about the best places to loot. Now, obviously, if you guys know how the landing system works, basically you're in a plane and it flies you across the map in a certain direction, meaning you cannot control exactly where you're gonna go. So the cities I'm gonna name and the areas I'm gonna name, if you're not on the path to go to those places, it's not something that you should go out of your way to try to fly towards that area, find a car and go towards it. If it's in the path and you hear one of the cities and it's in the path of where you're going, I think it, it, these are the best places to go in my opinion. If it's in the path, like I said, if it's not, I don't think going out of your way to go to these places is the best idea but these are the best places to loot they are pretty spread out it's not just like in one line so you're most likely going to go over one of these places if you're going into the spawn so the first thing is pretty obvious going into the cities where there's a lot of buildings it's obviously the best place to loot you know if there's a lot of buildings there's a lot of opportunities for guns to spawn helmets to spawn painkillers to spawn energy drinks to spawn all that stuff that heals you all the stuff to get you weapons all the stuff to get you more armor police vests military vests all that kind of stuff there's all the things in the buildings and where there's a lot of buildings there's going to be a lot of loot that's pretty self explanatory but there's a few cities that I found that have I don't know maybe increased loot chances or maybe I'm just crazy so the cities that I think are the best are George Pole, which is kind of towards the west side of the map like the northwest side of the map it's it's on the coast and then the next one is po Pochink Pochinki, I think it's called. It's in the like middle of the map, like direct middle of the map. Maybe a little bit to like the southwest side, but it's like kind of in the middle of the map. Yeah, so you you'll see it if you open the map and you're in the game, you'll see these two cities. The first one, like I said, is George Pole, and the second one is Pochinki. I don't know exactly how to say it, but those are the two that I found that have the best loot. Now, like I said, if you're going into a city and there's a lot of places, obviously there's going to be a lot of loot, but you know what else is going to be in those cities? A lot of people. So if you go to the suburbs or the farms that are like outside of the cities, those are also really good places because they tend to have like four to five buildings and they tend to have not as many people land at them because, you know, if it's like city or like suburbs, most people go to the city because there's more loot, you know, like I said. But if you go to like a suburb, then there's more loot to you because, you you know, when you go to those cities, you know, there's loot everywhere, okay, but everyone's going to steal it. So if you just go to a suburb where you're the only one there, then you're going to be the one getting all the loot and you're going to be able to kill the people in the cities that are under looted because everyone stole everything. If that didn't make sense, I'm sorry. I don't even know what I was saying for half the time. I was just kind of spitting bars right there. So a few other places to loot is the ruins next to Ponchinki, Pon pa whatever that one city we were talking about earlier. There's ruins, so basically it's like, it's basically a flattened like city, I guess you could say. So there's no like running indoors, running upstairs, stuff like that. Literally all it is, is just all spread out over the ground. You don't have to do all this, you know, fancy opening doors, going into attics, going upstairs, doing all that boring stuff. So that's kind of by Pochinki or whatever it's called. And the next thing is the score school near like Razhak, I think is what it's called. It's kind of hectic there, but it's a really big place. There's a lot of loot in it, and I think it's a it's a good place to to check. And the school, like I said, it's near the Razhak place. But if you go on your map, it's actually like a gigantic yellow square. Because if you guys know that the cities are like yellow, like the outlines of the buildings are yellow. So if you see a big giant square in the middle of the place, you're gonna see that that is in fact the school, and that is a very good place to loot because it's big and it does get kind of hectic there so you're gonna have to get some kills and guns pretty quickly but like I said I think it's a good place to loot and uh, if you can get there then uh, go for it so that's gonna be it for this video guys if you enjoyed drop a like subscribe to the channel I'll see you guys later peace out